Hello guys, welcome. This is another replay brought to you by the perf of this game uh of Fate Cosmos TV versus Catafair Far I don't know, I'll just call him Kate. Uh this will be a human versus work uh matchup on Secret Rally and uh there's no observers so I have, have I'll have to commentate from uh, one player's point of view. I'll just do it from the humans. I apologize for not doing the two games that I was going to do yesterday. Um, my friends was asking me to play some Dota games, and guess was over, so I had to had I had I think I had five shots of whiskey, and I was pretty dizzy. And, uh, my friends asked me to play more Dota. By the time we we're done, it was three in the morning. I had this replay up to do to be commented, but then I think I fainted, like just fell asleep on the table before I hit the record button, which is pretty. Uh, lucky of me, because if I record it already, I'll have like a really huge file that recorded nothing. Blade Master from uh, Kate, and maybe Archmage. Yes, Archmage fr uh, from Cosmos TV. Brad Cosmos done. Gonna have some more footman. Uh, Cosmos TV. I already have the secondary farm near completion. So once the footman comes out, he will have enough food to go for another footman. Bear is coming in. But Blade Master, um, you know, to me, usually that's not a secondary bird goes down. Usually that's not a surprise, but to me, I'm kind of surprised because, well, when I download this replay, uh, well, you'll, you'll know what I mean later. I think, uh, he'll just cancel this, maybe, just about now. He doesn't want to be out. Yeah, cancel Blade Master, builds a Shadow Hunter. Now, there's goes the surprise factor. Uh, sometimes downloading replays, they just show you too much information and spoils the game for you. Voodoo launch going down, Archmage is out, but the Shadow Hunter is uh, almost half a quarter out now, but he's not going to be. Uh, Workbird going down, this Peon is cleverly moving to the tower, going to cancel the Shadow Hunter, and we will see a Goblin Tinker for the work. Surprise, surprise. Uh, Archmage is going to creep this uh, no Overseer, get some nice items, let's see what it will be. Uh, two more intelligence, nice, plus two damage for the Archmage. And class of attack plus six. Uh, really nice item. On the Archmage, it's not, uh, um, very good, but it's definitely a nice addition. The Archmage is able to deal more damage now, which I'm sure will come in handy. Tinker just using the Pocket Factory. Such powerful, uh, spell to, cre uh, to do creepings, like, you can just creep some, uh, the Ogre Magic can, which is usually really hard to creep the entire can with a uh, grunt. Usually with the Blade Master, you just take out the Ogre Magic and that's it. And you stop uh, going that Tinker going awfully low. Uh, it will be bad if he goes down on well, creeping. Two more hits, one more hit, not gonna go down, maybe two more hits, but I'm not gonna take the risk. Grunt's uh, pretty low as well. Archmage not knowing this, gonna creep some more. And yeah, this will go down soundly. Scroll the beast, so that's a roar from the jewel of the claws from Night Elf. Uh, free roar. If you sell this, you'll get uh, I think 200 gold. But usually people like to keep it just for a major battle. Uh, uh, let's see. Is he gonna creep this? I think he'll creep this. Not sure. Cosmo TV is gonna creep this camp instead of harassing. Fate. Uh, Kate is gonna come in here and go for get some heal. Probably gonna creep. The no wardens as well, just get some items. Gets a dust of appearance just for the Blade Master, but Blade Master is not even in play uh, the, at this time. Two Cockroach Goblin, he will attack this warden, yes. And just gonna creep, he will be able to creep, that's no problem. Uh, Custom TV moving in, force on harass, taking the stronghold. So uh, he'll be pretty vulnerable right now. What was the drop? Real production plus two, really shitty item. But teleporting back as uh, the worker was on her ass. Will, will uh, Cosmo TV be able to take this down? Not likely, but now he is aware that Kate is, has went for a tinker. This murder will survive, uh, or I'm he's not going to take it down. <laughs> Human taking the keep. Arcan wall going down. Um, let's see, uh, Cosmos and, um, Katie's going a bit back and forth over there. 
work time is still trying to take this down. 1 p.m. repairing the work barrel. Stronghold will be finishing in just a second. Come on. Creeping this no no brute. Uh, getting another two more strings. So nice. Stronghold is completed. Also, keep is also completed. Not taking out the tomb though. Okay, there goes the tomb. Tinker runs into Archmage. Gonna hit him a few. No, not gonna attack Archmage. Didn't get a surround off that off of man either. Gonna try to take down this work bird over here. And Archmage with the plus six damage is able to deal more damage than usual. Gonna just try to take down this uh, work barrel. Archmage getting uh going half health there. Uh, well, not gonna take this down at this rate. There's uh four peons repairing it. Maybe another water water elemental that he will be. Yeah, water elemental. So now he will be taking this down. Just barely though. Archmage pretty low. Takes it down. See, I told you the I said the class of six class of attack plus six will come in handy. There goes the handiness of that. Gonna go in burrow to save this peon. This water elemental might go down to timer instead. No. Tinker comes in to finish it up before time expires. Mountain King has a sending letter here coming out from Human. Not uh, from Cosmos TV. Yeah, Human. Uh, Ark and Satan, so we will be seeing casters. Bisonieri, gonna maybe get cancelled? Not really. Yeah, I guess cancelled by Kate, so not. So he did not lose uh, all that gold. Oh, Pian getting the last off that on foot, man. So, uh, definitely epic. Getting more harassed on the Bicenary. Dual Bicenaries. No Spirit Ouch. Uh, uh, that's a War Mail. No Spirit Ouch. Surprise there. Uh, Archmage coming in just harassed even more. Wow. Level 3 Pocket Factory able to tank a bit, but the Bicenary will get cancelled. Yes, get cancelled again. So, uh, work is really delayed here. Cancelled again. Wow. He's really cons case should really consider building the Bicenary back in his base or somewhere. Not uh, too, mo too outward. Uh, two sources coming out. Just for the slow, the slow is really damaging. Oh, the Superman will go down to the creeps here as the night just passed, and so the creeps are awakened, and he was just there healing still. Pretty bad. A uh, beastinary, another beastinary attempt. I will say at this point, maybe getting taken down again. Unlikely, he came in on the wrong side, but we'll be seeing some towering uh, uh advances. Factory will, will go down. Casting slow, the sources just slows the tinker and the uh, the ground over there. T trying to take down this, these uh, peasants. Boat goes down on the tinker. Peasant really low, gonna go down. Yes, spear scar is being used to attack the archmage. Another boat goes on the ground. This ground will go down. This footman will likely go down as well. Footman goes down. Tinker uh, level three and a half. Mountain King not even close to level two. One tower goes does go down. Uh, Archmage also three something. Bit less than Tinker as that experience went to uh, Mountain King. So basically the same experience in total for both players. Scout tower. Oh, this is a scout. It's not even upgraded yet. So uh, this ground will go down. Magic damage from the sources, although low, but does do extra damage to the grunts more than the footman does. Yeah. Uh, what I'm just going and coming in and telling this ground some more visionary. Uh, the first one is completed. The second one is uh, almost near completed. Going to get uh, his uh, Cosmo TV is going to attempt to cancel this. Takes out the ground as well. Mounting uh, almost level two. This one man will go down to the burrows. Oh, maybe a surround off with sources. That'd be really nice. No, nope, but he, oh, Tinker is slow. Maybe it's not a surround attempt. Nope. Uh, Speed Scroll saves Tinker. No mana quite for another pocket factory. Oh, that, that Goblin Clockwork is able to do so much damage on death. It just explodes. Maybe use those Goblin Clockwork on the tower. They, they're immobile and they do take a lot of damage.